Hey YouTube, Opinionated Review ahead. Bring you guys a video on ProTube. It's by Jonas Jessner and it's in the Big Boss Repo for $149. Now, basically, what ProTube is, it's a more enhanced version of the um, iOS YouTube app. So, it's saying how Apple's YouTube app really should be. You feel me? Now, there's a long list of description here. You can go ahead and read that if you want to. And there's also some screenshot and a promotional video. Now, if you watch that promotional video, uh, it's going to sell this tweak or this modification or whatever. But I'm going to tell you guys what I think about it because I'm the opinionated reviewer and this is what I do. I'm not here to sell shit for the dev. I'm here to tell you what I think about an app. But now I'm going to go ahead. It adds a little app on your springboard. There's not to be configured. You just open up that app. And let me just go over to my um, page right here. And... It's much better than the default YouTube app. It is. But basically to me what the developer did, he, he just mimicked YouTube's mobile app and added like two features. You'll see what I'm talking about. So here's YouTube's mobile app. Inside my web, my Safari web browser on my iPhone 4S. Let me just scroll up. And here's ProTube, as you can see. It has all the same features as YouTube Mobile. The only thing is different is it adds like a download. Like you go ahead and save and download videos. So let me just go. I think I downloaded one of my own videos. So you can see right here I downloaded them. You can go ahead and save them as like an MP3. Or you can just download the whole entire video. So I'll just click on that video there. And then I'm going to go ahead and tap this little extra button. And I hit, I hit download. Not save. You go ahead and you just hit download. And you can choose whether you want to download the video or the mp3. I'm going to click it. And then I can go ahead. It's going to save it. So you can watch it offline if you want to and stuff like that. And you can edit it. You can change the name and stuff like that. So I could go ahead and change the name. Rename if I want to. All that good stuff. Done. It shows you a progress bar. I could slide to stop that. I could slide to delete these. And there's also... Um, you can copy the URL to this video. So you copy it and then you can go paste it in Twitter. The only thing that I'm disappointed that it doesn't have for my 149 is a shared button. Like I don't see a shared button, especially for iOS 5. There should be a shared button so I can go ahead and tweet this stuff, you know. But it may, if you're familiar with the YouTube app for here, it's just like that. The only thing is different. He has this URL thing to save videos and you can download videos. That's the only shit that's different. All of this, you can view your comments and your videos, all like how the, what the promotional video showed you. All of that gibberish is the same exact thing as this. You can watch videos in your Safari web browser too, just like how you can watch videos in this too. So I'm going to click on one of my videos, then I'll wait for it to load. Boom. And he said it supports, it supports landscape mode. This also supports landscape mode. So yeah, that's basically what I think about it. So yeah, that's basically what it is. It's just the mobile YouTube app with a couple, of, a couple like three other features or something like that. Because everything that the, the video said, oh, you can view the suggested videos in the comments. I can view the suggested videos in the comments as well here too. But that's my opinion, you know. It's called ProTube. There's not to be configured. It just adds a new icon to your springboard. It's in the Big Boss Repo for $149. It's a matter of preference if you want to get it or not. With that being said, please rate, comment, subscribe. Have a nice day.